we want your love and your laughter as you welcome our first sitcom on the stage, The Thrift Collection! Yay! Welcome to Honiton Metropolitan Museum, putting the R into art and the E into museum. And that is not patronising. That is how you all talk. Well, tell her not to run so suspiciously next time. How do you run suspiciously? <laughs> if she runs like that, I'll shoot her myself. Speaking of which, what would be your favourite gun, so? Favourite gun? What kind of psycho has a favourite gun? Off the top of my head, <laughs> in an urban situation, I'd go heckler and cock. Is he on his way? I'm starving. He never made it to the takeaway. There was this burning orphanage and he had to rescue a bunch of kids. And that puppet! Of course he did. What a prick. <laughs> it's such a Martin thing to do. He's always coming to the rescue. Like, ever since school, like the day we met, I just got beaten up and he gave me his jam sandwiches. That's such a Martin thing to do. Yeah. Okay, I know what you're thinking. So if Robin's the girl who left, why is Esme the girl who got away? Well. We have so much in common. Uh, Jackie Chan movies, uh, Kurt Vonnegut and Saturday morning uh, cartoons. Better than that, she knows the difference between a NES and a SNES. And she recognises the Streets of Rage 2 has the finest of all fighting games. <laughs> but I've been rowing for 16 months at this point and I'm not really good at taking risks. Besides, uh, she's coming to the uh, end of her drink and this is the point I've got to buy one and I've only got two quid so uh, then this happens. Hi, I'm Martin, Toby's friend. You guys want a drink? The rest is history. <laughs> selfish? <laughs> me selfish? After your affairs, after leaving me to raise the kids, you out night after night with your boring beige real ale friends. Uh, I might be some time. Uh, can you Sky Plus Game of Thrones, please? All to keep your <laughs> sense of self intact. After years of me cooking, washing and cleaning and putting up with your self-aggrandising bullshit. Me selfish! Well... You've got a fucking nerve, Jeff Townsend. I want a divorce and I want it now. Have you looked for a flat yet, Dad? Because there's a nice one near... Um, oh, well, get it up on right move. It won't come to that, Chloe. Yes, it will. Because you slept with those two women. You mean fat teenagers? One was in the year above me at school. Her nickname was Jabba the Hutt. She had a glandular problem. She had a pastry problem. Oh, that reminds me. I'm a bit peckish. Can you rustle up a late supper? Oh my god, you're one of those. One of what? One of those people who trolls friendship sites looking for a platonic relationship that they later manoeuvre into sex. Ooh, that is so creepy. <laughs> <laughs> That's so peep. I am not a creep. If anyone's a creep here, it's Kanish. Kanish isn't creepy. He's straightforward. I can be straightforward. Let's do an experiment. Kanish, I want to have no strings, hot, dirty sex right now. Are you up for it? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and you? Yes. No. It's not that simple. You haven't defined what no strings means. It's bound to have some effect on our future interactions. <laughs> Unless you use the Gendakin experiment where time resets itself. <laughs> What's he doing? <clears throat> I doubt you'll be needing this tonight. Oh, really? Really. And I'm going to tell you for why. I wish you would. Tonight, I will defeat you. I will fight you, and I will scrap you, and I will get you down, right down in the dirt, and squirm and bite and humiliate myself if I have to. If that's what it takes to win this game. So you better ask yourself the question. One for air. <laughs> Do you have the brass balls for this battle? And if... As I suspect the answer is no, then maybe you should forfeit right now and save your face in front of your new little friend. Two things, sis. One, might want to have a mint. Two, <laughs> bring it. Then may Waddington's have mercy on your soul. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Shell, have you and Martin been seeing each other long? Oh, no, we're not... I mean, it, it's just... The uh, thing is, I've, I've left a long-term relationship. Oh, sorry to hear that. Don't be. He was a massive tool. <laughs> he must have been to let someone like you slip through his fingers. Bags the dog! <laughs> <laughs> I bags it first! Bullshit! I got it! <laughs> Guys! Why don't you go with something more appropriate to your personality, sis? Say the leathery old boot? <laughs> <laughs> well, if personality is the criteria you should have... Oh, wait. There is 
no pea shaped like an annoying ass.